Hey everybody, welcome back to Nico Brothers. We're out here at Copar Yard, bright and early in the morning. Basically, we're not just doing a walk around, we want to pick something up today, around $10,000, that's our budget. You know, it's plus or minus, it's not a science, but hey, at least we have a goal. So basically, the first one on our list is this 2022 Chevy Colorado. Let's check it out. All right, so Chevy Colorado, looks like it's all been taken apart. Um, interior looks really clean, it's got some good miles on, it's got some back seats. Let's see if the hood opens. Is it going? And then we got this thing missing. Ooh, we have a bumper, we have a rim. So that's looking good. One time we bought one, and the bed wasn't even screwed on. Let's see if this thing's screwed on. And it's not. No so it's got no power. But the bed's not screwed on. Let's check out the frame. Frame looks okay. What do you think, Michael? Because the parts are here. I mean, that's yeah, but I, I think fixable. I think this is bigger here, a little bit of there. That means the frame yeah, kind of bent. Could have been. That happens really naturally. These frame rails aren't that like big anymore, like they used to be. But probably we can't fix. I mean, if we can get it like around that price, we can fix it pretty yeah, big. Twenty twenty two. That's nice. I just don't have any miles around this thing. Yeah. All right. So we got a pop tire, a bad fender, no big deal. Some damage right there, no big deal. And the bed has damage, so a little bit more damage than I thought, but I guess we'll see what it goes for. Michael said around 13,000 miles. Not bad. Alright guys, so super excited about this one. Hopefully we'll be able to pick it up for a good deal. But let's check out the damage, the good, the bad. Looking around, like I said, the auction is starting like right now. Always. It's always that way. Let's see what's going on with it. Alright, so the knee assembly is missing, Michael. Is it bad? Looking at the ears, we're to bolt up the lower control arm. I say it looks good. That's not bad. The upper control is still there too. That's nice. It's nice when just the ball joint rips out and not everything off the frame. So Yeah, so fenders definitely needs to be replaced. This door is good, this door is good. The knee assembly's right here, look. Okay. That means we've got a rim. Four wheel drive. The tire's still good. I don't know why the muffler's there. Maybe it's not this car, hopefully not. Looks like they have bolted something. We'll see if it's got some power in it. Okay. So this side is looking good. Got a little dent right there. Dent on the door, we can fix that. Another fender, headlight, bumper, and we're done. So this could be a nice little rebuild. Interior is pretty nice. Any airbags deployed? Two sets of keys. That's that's you know. But did the airbags deploy? Oh, don't look okay. like it. So this could be possibly a nice little fix. Oh, oh my! The battery's right there. It's cold too. Man. All right, we got a couple more to look at because the thing, but I I like it because the frame's good. Yeah, Using really a knee assembly. Bad. I think it'll start up. I mean, 37,000 miles on it, very clean, well taken care of. Let's check on the hood real quick, but overall, good deal, hopefully. All right, so radiator support looks good. That's not bad, actually. Just dirty, replace the bumper, yeah. maybe a grill, a headlight. The assembly, bander. Be a nice, quick rebuild. Oh, Only yeah. take like 10 minutes. Maybe two days, realistically, <laughs> but yeah. All right, so the next one we got on this list is another truck. And uh, it's a 2019 or 2020. It's a Ram. It looks pretty cool, but the hit, what did it hit? It's a rough country lift kit, not too bad. It's got red, red rear damage too, so I got this whole side needs to be fixed. That needs to be fixed, that needs to be fixed. It's a lot of work, Michael. Look at that. It's got a rough country lift kit on it. That's nice. But it's got a lot of damage. Dang. But I mean, if we get it for the price, why not? It's got power. Power's nice. 94,000 miles, but I don't know. I think I like those red trucks first. This is nice. Let's start, let's see what it sounds like. Maybe it's got an exhaust. Transmission, it's not in D. Yeah, it doesn't want to shift. It's a sign. Yeah, that's a bad sign. Let's watch it and we'll see what it goes for. Yeah, I'm not gonna give too much for it. But this side is bad. Let's check out the other side really quick. 
just in case we get a, it's a 4x4. This side's pretty nice. I guess we'll watch it. All right, guys, so this thing is literally playing first one on the list. Auction starts in about five seconds, so it's pretty exciting. You want to be the one, you know, get the first vehicle and the last vehicle in the middle. People get all excited. They want to pick stuff up, so bidding starts right now. Let's go. We got ourselves 6700 Our budget is around 10 k Let's see what happens. Bid plays, bid plays. Ooh, all right, right away. People going at it. $7,000, we're winning, and we're outbid, just like that. It's still exciting. I don't know how many cards we play, but like the whole auction feel, it's definitely something gets your blood pumping for sure. Especially it's really cold. Yeah, so you kind of need it. It's crazy how easy you could win a car or lose one. All right, Evan, should I go aggressive? I feel like I should still be aggressive at the beginning. It's I nice mean, we truck. do like that red truck though. That red truck is nice. And I'd rather get that red truck over this truck. It's pure sale, 2022, 13,000 miles on it. It says 12,900. We're winning for 8,300. It's not bad. Last time, 8,300. This, this is good. This is a good sign. Win the first vehicle of the day. And we'll go home. We're good to go. Oh, I'll bid. By Texas. No, I'm telling them. I want it. Stay off Texas. They got a lot of shipping they got to pay. They have so many trucks in Texas. Why do they want the one from South Carolina? I mean, we did take a lot of trucks out of Texas, though. We, we did. So I, I, that's fair. That's fair. 8,700. He's bidding me up again. 300 bucks more, but we're still in budget. And like I said, there's parts inside. South Carolina getting the race. Man, this bonus time. We almost had it. I mean, there was other people checking this truck out today, too. Yeah, we've seen people walking around. But here we go. 8,000. Oh, 9,000 from Virginia. New bidder coming to play. 9,100. It's right here. Right there. Don't they know? I mean, there's a local yard. We could, like, push it home. We're right there. Oh, yeah, drive it home. We won 9,100. I think that's a steel deal. 2022, low miles, less than 20,000 miles. But we think. never started it. We did it, but, I mean, we've seen the damage. Should be fine. Should be fine. Should be fine. A lot of money we just put into it. We never started. We should definitely get a drop box. But, hey, auction's moving. Let's keep going. Here we go, guys. Our 2020. Our? What, did we win it? Well, the one we want. It's We're, a little over budget already, Ivan. How much is it at? 12,000. Uh, out of country, you know, Missouri. So far away. 12.6. I mean, it's still not bad. I mean, we're trying to stick around the 10K, but that can be like 12K, 13, 14. So we're at 13 right now, but it's a $40,000 truck. But we already bought a truck too. We did. So we we're technically good, but man, so nice. I know. I'd rather have this for sure. Can we reject the other one? No. You win it, you win it. You click it. You got it, so once you pay like a crazy fee and stuff. So we're at 14000 right now. It makes sense. I mean, we thought it was going to go for a lot. But you never know because the knee assembly, maybe it's got frame damage, you know. No airbags yeah. deployed, which is good. It's a hot ticket item. Like if we didn't win the other truck, then yeah, I might probably try it. But this is already fourteen six bonus time. Fourteen six, have it, Kentucky. Should I click it? They can have it. <sighs> yeah. It's fine. We already got stuff to do. Can't get greedy. We got one. We still got a couple more playing, so we know, yeah. you know. We'll check it out, but this is over budget already. And then, like I said, there might be other stuff. And we didn't start it, so. 14A Kentucky. They got it sold, 14A. Plus fees, or you're 15-something already, so. Like 15A, probably. Yeah, probably 15A, 16 by the time we get it home. Well, that's not bad. I think they got a good deal. All right, there'll be more. Yeah, can't win them all. All right, guys, so I would say it was a great day fishing here at Copart. We got ourselves the first one of the cash, the Colorado. The other ones went for a little too much. You know, you win some, you lose some. No big deal, but we didn't miss anything. So that's what matters, and I, I think it's a great deal. You know, what a fender, a little bit of work. Yeah, plus we're going to fix it. Yeah, we're going to get it all the way, so make sure you stay tuned. Don't, you know, make sure you subscribe so you're going to miss out. We're going to get this thing back on the road in no time. I think it's definitely worth fixing. Low miles 2022, so it's pretty cool. But thanks so much for watching. Make sure to leave some comments. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks for all your support, guys. We'll catch you next time.